Aries, good morning, welcome to your reading. My name's Clive, you're watching Embers Tarot. This is a general reading, sun, moon, rising. This is for everybody, new viewers, new subscribers, cross watchers, you're all very, very welcome. It's a great honor to be here and read for you. Okay, the only other message I've got for you before we start is please take the bits that resonate, leave the rest. Don't try and make it fit, this will just lead you to wrong conclusions, okay? So here we go. What's going on for the sign of Aries? What's going on for the sign of Aries? You have Queen of Swords, Eight of Cups, Knight of Pentacles, Nine of Wands, Ace of Pentacles, Nine of Cups, Seven of Pentacles, you have the King of Cups, you have the full card, bonus card is Page of Pentacles. Basically what you're doing is there's you're weighing up the pros and cons of a certain situation on getting communication coming in. Alright. But it's your dearest wish okay to be with somebody you like a lot. All right. Now, whether they're married or not, or living with somebody else, I'm kind of getting that uh, you are treating this person with a great deal of respect. All right. Your emotions are fully in control. You are in the energy of a new romantic cycle, Aries. All right. Now, like I say, I am getting communication coming in. Now, despite the problems of the past, okay, you are being very cautious, but also you're being very respectful. I'm kind of getting that you have got something to say to this person. It's kind of like you want to tell them exactly where you stand with this person. All right. Now, things have been pretty slow but you're pretty sure of yourself at the moment, okay? You have calmed things down a lot and perhaps you even separated from this person, all right? Now, I'm getting a coming back together, all right? There is a new avenue opening up for you. You do see it as very, very risky a lot of you are willing to consider going forward with this, okay, despite what's happened in the past. You're not necessarily dealing with an ex. This is just some getting that, like I say, it's a general read, take it out, resonate. This is just somebody that you feel that there has been a lot of complications due to circumstances, due to attitudes. Hmm. There is the realisation that if you want to pursue this, it's going to be a long haul to get what you want out of it. Okay, And that doesn't mean you're being selfish. You, you're after stability. You're after continuity. I'm kind of getting that, you know, it's, you're being very studious. You're being very cautious. Okay, You do want to play things very, very differently. Now, I'm getting that you do want to commit with this person on a certain level, but because of complications either with a child or, like I say, circumstances, your work, distance, whatever, you know, it's kind of like you're being very, very grounded. You, you're seeing the reality of it. There is the connection with this person, but it seems that they... They find it difficult to accept things on your terms. They see you as a bit dictatorial. Okay, but this is, I'm kind of getting there's a false impression here. Like I say, there are things changing. Some of these changes are outside of your control. But I'm getting a new beginning. I'm getting communication coming in. Your perspective being changed 
but with this perspective changing you'll see the truth about yourself you'll see the truth about the situation all right well, i'm getting that there is like i say been complications in the past they they want to they do want to talk to you but it's a question of a decision for both of you what's good for everybody okay there has been a lot of arguments in the past with some of you I'm getting this is coming to terms with each other's opinions you know this ace of swords it is a new beginning and it does does hold a victory but that victory depends on how well you can adapt to the changes and it does depend on what you both decide okay It was a struggle. I'm kind of getting that, you know, you there has been a separation here, or you're in the process of a separation, and you you are coming to terms with it. Okay, it it has locked up a lot of your energies. All right, this person does test your patience a lot, but you are now in the process of making a decision. There is something new here for you. And I am kind of getting that you are at least emotionally separating from the past. You, you're also in the process in general terms of cutting people out of your life. You know, people that's not bothered with you for a long, long time. You know, you, you, you're kind of energetically decluttering. You're clearing your energy areas. It's taken a lot of, taken a lot out of you. You first learnt that an aggressive posture with this personal situation is not the answer, so you're being a lot more passive about it. Mm. I'm also getting here for some of you travel in the near future. Okay. There's, there's a sudden impulse to get away or go see somebody. Hmm. For a long time, Aries, you've not known exactly what it is you want, but now you are, like I say, the moment your perspective is changing about this situation, about life, where you work, about the people you're dealing with, okay, there has been a lot of introspection here. The universe is granting your wish, it's giving you the power, okay, to. And giving you the green light to actually act. You just need to know where exactly what it is you want and where you want to go. You are coming to that. It's like I say, you're decluttering. All right. Now, I am getting that you're perhaps in a situation where you're dating somebody or living with somebody very loyal, very supportive. And then this person is is a very, very different way of thinking, very different way of approach. So now for some of you, you've got a choice between two people. Okay. I'm also getting Libra energy here. This is Libra energy. Okay. It would seem for a long time that this person couldn't make up their mind. And finally, there's a breakthrough. I am kind of getting that they're perhaps dealing with legal issues. They couldn't move, but now there's this kind of green light. I am kind of getting that energetically they were asking, if not physically asking you to wait, be patient, they will sort it out. A lot of them are dealing with the air signs, Libra energy, dealing with uh, legal issues here. As I say, this could be distance. This could be with a marriage, this could be with a separation, this could be anything over a child. But there is, I'm getting genuine feelings between you and this person. All right, you do feel you've been going around in circles, but this this repetitive cycle is now being broken. All right. There is feelings for this person from your point of view, they've got feelings for you. But it's, I'm kind of getting the coming to terms with each other it's discussing how much time and energy you're both willing to put into this 
Now, whatever energy you put in, the rewards will be in relationship to that energy. There is travel here. All right. It does have a lot of implications. It means difference in lifestyle. All right. And it does need that proverbial leap of faith on kind of getting a lot of you are looking for certainty. Well, there's only one thing certain in life, and that's change. Everything else is just by the by. It's what we make of it. You know, from a tarot point of view, um, my personal opinion is relationships change, they come and they go. It's how you react to those relationships. But if you go into a, any relationship thinking it's going to last forever, it's going to be the, for the rest of my life, then this, is, this can lead to disappointment. Okay, so what I'm getting here is with you, especially with this, you're pretty much open in your attitude now. You've learned from experience. Mm. You do have feelings for this person, but as I say, you're not giving away the game yet. All right, but I'm kind of getting there's a good chance here that you two can work things out if you choose to. I could say it's a general reading. Some of you will walk away from this completely. Okay. Because you see it as too one-sided. But, you know, you've been carrying a lot of burdens for the last 10 years, Aries. Now there's finally focus. And with cooperation between you two and good, honest discussion, okay, there's no reason why you can't work this out. I'm seeing nothing here that is as any permanence about it. Hmm. I'm seeing the truth finally revealed. And I'm seeing you being able to adapt to the changes. That will not guarantee your success, but it will certainly improve your chances. Thanks very much for watching.